new superbug is being reported at hospitals and health facilities. And it's catching the attention of federal health officials. CBS News' Hillary Lane reports from Hackensack on what's being done to stop its spread. Making sure every room in the hospital is safe and clean is a priority for Dr. Carol Barsky. The chief quality officer of Hackensack Meridian Health in New Jersey says there are many places germs can linger. Our approach here is to have those strong infection control practices every day in every patient, every person. The latest superbug to emerge is a fungus called Candida auris. Since 2016, more than 680 cases have been reported in hospitals and long-term health facilities in 12 states. Now, researchers from the CDC have found patients with very high levels of C. auris on their skin can shed the fungus and contaminate their environment. We found a correlation to the amount of candida on the skin to the amount of candida on the bed rail. We know it, it can survive on skin for very long periods of time. The CDC says people who get serious C. auris infections are usually sick and hospitalized with other conditions. More than one in three patients die. It is acquiring or developing, evolving resistance quite rapidly and readily. It is hard to kill. Dr. Barsky says Hackensack is diligent about sanitizing rooms daily and in between patients and has not had any C. auris cases. Now they're testing a new UV technology called Purple Sun, which disinfects a room in 90 seconds. Wherever high touch areas are, those are more likely to harbor the organisms we're talking about. Dr. Barsky also reminds staff, patients, and families that good hand hygiene is critical to keep germs from spreading. Hillary Lane, CBS News, Hackensack, New Jersey. While the fungus is resistant to some antibiotics, the CDC says new treatments are in clinical trials.